Cats have come a long way, from saber-toothed hunters to glorified throw pillows. Here's how their journey evolved and what the future might hold. One, they started as apex predators. Millions of years ago, giant cats like Smilodon dominated the food chain. With saber teeth and raw power, they hunted large prey and feared nothing. Two, they were built for solitude. These ancient cats were not social. They hunted alone, lived alone, and didn't need your approval or your couch. Three, extinction made way for evolution. When prey disappeared, so did many prehistoric cats. The survivors adapted, becoming smaller, more flexible, and slightly less terrifying. Four, domestication was a strategic move. About 9,000 years ago, wildcats started hanging around human settlements, not out of love, but because humans were messy and left food lying around. Five, they became useful roommates. Cats hunted rats in grain stores. Humans notice. A silent deal was made. You kill pests, we feed you. Cats, fine, but we still won't come when called. Six, from partner to idol. Ancient Egyptians worshiped cats. They were seen as divine, mysterious, and above all, unbothered. The human obsession had officially begun. Seven, modern cats embrace leisure. Today's cats live in heated homes, eat premium food, and get carried around in strollers. Evolution didn't make them lazy, we did. Eight, they still have predator instincts. Even house cats retain their hunting behavior. That gift on your doorstep, it's their way of saying, I could kill if I wanted to. Nine, the future is feline and strange. Looking ahead, we may see cybernetic cats, hover cats, and AI-enhanced emotional manipulators. Don't laugh, they're already halfway there. 10, cats didn't just survive, they outsmarted us. From prehistoric killers to pampered freeloaders, cats evolved by doing less and getting more. It's not laziness, it's efficiency.